Hello friends, friends, you are welcome back to my channel. Friend, thank you so much, friends, for watching. If today is your first time of seeing this video, hello, my name is Becky. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. In today's video, guys, as you can see, we're going to be using lemon. In today's video, guys, I'm going to give you a perfect method, a perfect way to get rid of your unwanted tattoo. This remedy that I'm going to be sharing with you guys, this remedy work well. I've seen a lot of testimony. I've seen a lot of people using it and I've, I've saw a lot of review about how to use lemon in a perfect way with salt to remove your tattoo. I'm going to show you step by step what you can do, how you can do, how to remove it in an effective way without your tattoo to be affected. All right. So as you can see, you be going to be using lemon. We all know that lemon contains a blushing property. As you can see, the first ingredient is going to be lemon. You can't use lime. You really have to get lemon. So the reason why we're using lemon, lemon, lemon is the best method to remove or light the tattoo. It is a natural blushing agent due to a natural acid present in it. It's going to be cutting this. We're gonna cut it into four. As you can see the thumbnail, you cut it into four. Yeah? Yeah. So guys, you see? So you get a lot, you get a quantity, good quantity of salt. A good quantity of salt. It depends. We really need the salt. This we really need a good quality of salt. We are going to use the salt and the lemon to sand the tattoo. So I will be showing you. I saw a lot of you guys as well. You can go and share the review of this. I saw a lot of good review, a good, very review of this. It's a very straightforward, we don't have to waste time. So you soak all the salt that you really, really, really need. So this is how it's going to go. So you can keep this inside the salt and then uh, you're gonna be using it time to time. So when you are use, when you are doing this ritual, when you are doing this remedy, guys, I will advise you use because this one is concentrate. Do it once in a week, okay? So I'm going to be demonstrate. So you leave the the salt to go to soak at least for five to ten minutes. Let's say ten minutes. Just leave the salt to go inside, and I shall be right back after ten minutes. We leave salt. Always leave the salt in a lukewarm place or in a lukewarm place. Don't put it in the fridge. So I'm going to leave this salt to go to, to soak with the lemon liquid. With the lemon, the liquid from the lemon, we're going to leave it to soak very well. So we are going to leave the lemon, the lemon, and the salt to soak together. You're going to leave this lemon at least 10 minutes. Let them soak together. After 10, min 10 minutes, you're going to start using it. You are going to use it to sand the face of the tattoo. So it's going to get rid of the of the layers and uh, it's going to cure it. its consistency. It's not going to happen a day, you know? you. You can't use a medicine for cough and you expect the cough to, to cure that very day. It's gradually. So it's going to go. So you'll be using this because it's too strong. It's very concentrated. You're going to be using it at least twice in a week. So you're going to choose the perfect day and the perfect time that is really suits you. So then you're going to repeat the process. So now it's 10 minutes. So we're going to go ahead So you dump it back into the salt. 
so you're going to start using it for your tattoo you're going to sand this at least for 30 minutes you keep sanding it one spot i will advise you to start to start from one spot before you go to another spot so you sound the area for consistency for 30 minutes and you let it this you let the salt dry let it dry away when you dry away, you're going to rinse it. So I'm going to go ahead, guys. I'm going to go and rinse it. So after 30 minutes, you, after sanding it for 30 minutes, you leave it for another 30 minutes to dry. When you dry, you want, you want to rinse it with lukewarm water. Guys, I want to go and rinse this. Use coconut oil. The reason why I'm using raw coconut oil because raw coconut oil contains contain bleaching properties so get yourself organic organic coconut oil you are you are not going to use olive oil you are going to use raw coconut oil all right so you apply it to the effect area after rinsing it when you're rinsing it guys after I rinse this guys when you rinse it so you're going to get some of the coconut oil you see it's organic so you're going to rub it you apply it after rinse it then you leave it always use coconut oil when you are doing a solution or you are doing any remedy or anything you are doing you are using to remove your tattoo apply coconut oil coconut oil contains a bleaching property as well and it works fast it works effectively so guys i saw this i say i have to share it with you i saw this on facebook and people were actually testify people write a good comment and a good a good review i just say no because me and this tattoo we have to have a particular home remedy to remove the tattoo so i just say i will share this with you guys so you don't have to throw this away leave it in a room temperature don't put it in the fridge you can continue use it for another two to three months so choose a day twice in a week and apply apply coconut oil guys if you are new to this channel please subscribe to our channel we upload video we upload new video every week subscribe to this channel and share this video and guys we are going to leave you with this stay blessed bye for now